मॉड्यूल सिक्स लेक्चर थर्टी साइबर अटैक एंड प्रिवेंशन फॉर पोर्ट स्कैनिंग पोर्ट स्कैनिंग इज यूज टू फाइंड दी ओपन पोर्ट्स इन ए कंप्यूटर सिस्टम आफ्टर कलेक्टिंग दी आई पी डिटेल्स ऑफ टारगेट एंड ऑनलाइन सिस्टम इन द नेटवर्क अटैक विल फाइंड दी ओपन पोर्ट्स इन दी ऑनलाइन सिस्टम फॉर फर्दर अटैक्स ये जनरली टू टाइप्स ऑफ पोर्ट स्कैनिंग वन इज ओरिजेंटल पोर्ट स्कैनिंग सेकेंड इज वर्टिकल पोर्ट स्कैनिंग Horizontal scan is described as a scan against a group of IPs for a single port. Vertical port scanning is described as a single IP being scanned for multiple ports. Port scanning methods. There are different scan types and used to find the open ports. The below are some general and well known scan method used with Nmap tool for the port scanning. Sin scan, full connect scan, fin scan, Xmas scan, and idle scan. Sin scan is also known as half open port scan because it does not complete the three-way handshake with the target. The below is the network packet capture from the Wireshark. In the first image, an attacker with IP address 192.168. 73 port 135 send a packet with sin flag on port 135 to the target target will reply a packet with flag sin plus ag now attacker send another packet third packet with reset flag to reset the connection attacker identify the open port 135 on the server second attacker send a packet with sin flag on port 80 to the target target replies to the attacker with reset plus acknowledgement flag in the packet because the port is closed on the machine note acknowledge flag will be sent for every packet received by the device as an acknowledgement of the first packet tcp is a level protocol provide confirmation for packet delivery the same flag communication we can see in the picture below understand why system sending this packet when tcp port is open system will reply with sin plus ag flag if port is closed system will reply with reset plus ag flag full connect scan this is another type of scan it completes the three way handshake with the target the attacker first send the packet with sin flag target reply with sin plus ag if the port is open the attacker will send the ag flag and complete the three way handshake and send the reset flag with another packet to reset the connection otherwise target system will also wait for the communication to start which can cause high utilization of cpu and memory in the second image attacker sent a packet with sin flag and received a response with reset plus ag flag because the port is closed the port and for more understanding please review the previous slide udp scan attacker sent a udp packet on port 135 if port is open no response will be observed because udp is unreliable protocol it never worries about the packet delivery confirmation or not in the second image attacker sent udp packet on port 135 and received a reply with icmp port unreachable it means the port is closed same you can see in the real packet capture in the previous slide fin xms and null scan is another type of scan used for port scanning in fin scan attacker will send a packet with fin flag only in xms scan the attacker will send the combination of flag combination of flag urgent push and fin to the target in the null scan no flag only the packet a blank packet will be sent to the target if no response observed or received 
then with argit the port is open and if reset plus ack flag is received from the target port is closed horizontal port scanning horizontal port scanning is described as a scan against a target of group of ips for a single port in the image the attacker is scanning for group of ips for a single port vertical port scanning is described as a scan against a single ip for multiple ports in the below image attacker is scanning for multiple ports for single ip attack prevention ips has signature related to this scanning the below are the responsibility for soc and the list keep monitoring the ips signature for this kind of scanning and validate the activity if the activity is authorized and legitimate one find in the false positive events identify any unauthorized activity of scanning from external ip look up for the ip information check for the reputation of the external ip address check the other logs like other firewall logs ips ids logs server logs and find any malicious activity if required block ip address immediately on the firewall thank you